We've seen several transactions inbound whereby uh, um, pro uh, players from abroad come to Italy and make acquisition, but we haven't seen that many Italian companies making acquisition abroad. So do you think Italian companies are ready and have the size that which is necessary to make purchases abroad? Um, it depends what you what you're looking at. I mean, we have uh, we have big Italian companies. I mean, such as Luxottica that have been making amazing acquisition, very successful. The companies I'm investing in are medium small small medium companies, 50, 60, 70 million euro company, um, and they are growing so much in their uh, organic business that uh, acquisition is not the first priority. Um, on the same time, uh, given the, 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 the level of growth that they're experiencing, I'm, I'm talking about 20-30% a year, entering new continents basically every single year, the real issue is about uh, uh, management, which is they have to improve and, and add some new management to the to. Given that to me, for instance, acquisition, the first important question you should ask yourself is, do I have the people that can manage? The new, the, the target, the new, the new acquired company, and given that this company already lack management within their organic path, um, I think that I mean, it's sometimes is even it's probably too early. These companies lack systems, lack process, lack management with respect to the level of growth that they are doing. I mean, growing at thirty percent a year is like uh, for a child to grow half a meter in a year. It's something that is very, very nice to see from a financial performance, but it's very hard as a challenge to be managed. What kind of support do you as a private equity operator can give to those companies and are private equity operators ready to do the job? To give support? I cannot speak for the other private equity operators because uh, uh, I don't know them uh, internal process. I can tell you what we do, it's, which is exactly what I've told you before. Systems, process, management, uh, understanding fo and focusing on the real efforts, understanding how that uh, in, in order to book revenues and successful business in a lot of geography, we actually sell through our companies in 92 c countries around the world. It's a lot of work. You need to not only make revenues, but collect revenues. You need to protect you against currencies. You need to be able to insurance against uh, all, all your furnitures. It's it's uh, it's it's complex. It's doable, but it's complex. But uh, but if you do it, you create value. Uh, we just sold the company to an American uh, industrial trade buyer, and what I really like of the transaction is the fact that not only they bought a company and that in order to get a, a product portfolio out of it, but I also made this small Italian company, they are pivot, they are head office for the entire European business. So you have a two billion plus American uh, conglomerate buying a very small Italian companies and making it their center for the entire European business of all the businesses, which I think is, it proves the fact that even small businesses can be adapted and made eligible for such, for such transactions. Thank you very much.